have Rowan Kabanum running 456 here recording some more Sonic in the Black Knight. So yeah, last time we defeated King Arthur and uh, went through the credits and stuff like that. And now it turns out the game is not over yet. We have to go to this place, Knight's Passage. So beat the clock, reach the goal before time runs out. Let's freaking do this. Here we go, here we go, here we go, skadoosh. Yes, and I'm just tossing out references and everything all over the place and just like in less than 30 seconds of this video. <laughs> and look at them go off in a puff of smoke. What the? I know, right? Oh snap, Your they're gonna king kill us. Nothing more than an illusion my grandfather conjured up. You'd better start explaining, Merlina. Merlina! We You! How did you come by that scabbard? Where is the king? Wait. This was all he left after he disappeared in a puff of smoke. Just like one of the knights of the underworld. There was never any King Arthur. What? Huh? Well done. And thank you, Sonic. <laughs> With this scabbard, I can erase my grandfather's greatest mistake. Oh no. It looks like she's turning evil herself. Yeah. Oh no. I shall make this king. Oh my gosh, she used me. Holy flipping balls. Wow. Oh, CGI cutscene time. Heck yeah. Look at the amazing awesome sauciness of it all. Skadoosh, yeah! Look at this go. Turn this down. Oh my gosh, what a beast. What a flippin' beast. Did you see that? That cutscene was awesome. Sorry, I did have that volume pop up for a second. It was blaring in my room. That's why I was like trying to turn it down. Okay, so looks like uh, we have some new uh, enemies and a new stage right here. So see those enemies? It's kind of like they look like squid or something. They all pop out like beams at you and stuff like that. So you want to make sure you don't get hurt by them. Take that, you sons of guns. All right. So it's time to go hardcore time, baby. Skadoosh! Heck yeah! Now I always say that whenever I do that move. Skadoosh and then heck yeah. I don't know why. Oh, dadnabbit. No one does that to the Skadooshinator. You sit your butts down, boy. Pay some respect to the new king now, who vanquished King Arthur himself. Oh, snap. You can just chop through that with the... Uh, Oh, we got some more enemies right here. Knights from the Underworld, okay. But, uh, yeah, you can just slice through the water. I don't know how you do that, but, uh, it's pretty interesting. So, just take these legions of devils and underworld beings out of here. So, yeah. <laughs> Did you see that? That was a reference to Sonic and the Secret Rings. That's pretty funny. If I do say so myself. Whee! Slicing through water! Yay! Skadoosh! Alright. Oh my gosh! No! That was totally on accident. I didn't realize there were spikes all over the place. Okay. Oh my gosh! Woo! Good thing that did not touch that. Alright. Whoa! Check! 
It's like all hell is breaking loose, okay? Where do you move? Oh my gosh, whoa. Hello. Okay, we got some goop here. Oh my gosh, avoid the slime! Oh! And we're sliding down. This level is pretty crazy, but I love it. This stage is really awesome, especially with Sonic. Okay, dodge that. Okay, I just totally missed every single one of them. Alright, so here we are on the boat ride. Now, this time it actually does matter sometimes if you switch from side to side. Because, uh, as you see right here, you want to be on this side. Right here, you want to be on that side. Watch out for the rocks. Take this, you sons of tools. That's all you are, a bunch of tools being used. Because it's, it's always funny. Armies, like, they're just dying, like, for, like, I don't know. I was going to say something, but, uh, then my mind just blanked out a bit fast. That's what people like, that's what happens to people like me. People who have short attention spans. Wee, look at us go. Hop, 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 Wee, 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 wee. Look at this dude spazzing out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Chop these dudes up. Oh, yeah. Oh, dang it. I didn't time my splice right. Hoppity, 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 hoppity. All right. Yeah, sometimes that wobbling will kill you. Pretty funny. Oh yeah! Don't mess with me. All right, we just automatically hop right here. You can hop down if you want to to get some treasure. If you could actually get it. Scroosh! Take all you tools out. Climb up here. Oh man, that was close. If I had not release that right at that instant I would have been dead like well I would have gotten hit okay jump right there Wee! look at this girl skadoosh whoa hello I did not expect you here oh hello all right okay so just keep chopping these idiots up you can climb up here, and, uh, wee! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! The B button's not working! I call that shenanigans. Freaking shenanigans. It's not like I could do anything right there. The game did it on its own. I couldn't do anything. So, can you bl- Ah, dag man. Can you blame me? Oh yeah! Little quick step right there. Awesome sauce. We got the gold. Three stars. Not bad, actually, to be honest. Usually, you gotta be really good to get, like... You have to, like, be really upgraded with, uh, your character. Oh, yeah, and, uh, this is not a 100% LP. Like, I think I said earlier in my video. Am I LP? I think I said that. I'm not too sure. But, um, basically, games like like Sonic and the Secret Rings in this game, if you did 100% LP, you would be doing it forever, basically. Like, trying to get 100%, because you have, there's so many upgrades and so many items and everything. It would take, like, half a year to finish this LP if I did it 100%. It's only a matter of time before the kingdom is consumed. You get your butts up and do something about it. Are you gonna give up just like that? Is that the best that chivalry of yours can do? How dare you! You got too much pride, Knuckles. It's like I said before, isn't there more to being a knight than serving a king? Sir Sonic is right. And there's still time if you act now. 
The power of the square. Swords to form a barrier around the castle. For the kingdom and its people. For the kingdom and its people. Let's do this. I'm counting on you. Sir Sonic, what will you do? Once the barrier's up, I'll look for a chance to jump in. Surely you jest. Nah, it's just how I roll. So we're from the hood. Well. It's all good we in the hood. We shall fulfill our appointed task. Heck yeah, that's just how, that's just how Sonic rolls. Alright, three Knights of the Round Table are now usable, so we can play as other characters now in the last four stages. The Cauldron is a new mission that's been added. The Great Megalith and the Shroud of Fortress. Alright. Okay. Um, I always feel like the best stage to start with first is the Great Megalith. I don't know why, but um, I just feel that way. We're going to be playing this time with uh, Gawain. He's usually the character I like to play on this stage. Um, let's go to Blacksmith briefly and uh, upgrade our items here. So let me see right here. Weapon. I think we can... Yeah, see here? Here you can use items you gained in missions to craft weapons for the Knights of the Round Table. Equipping these crafted weapons will give various effects. So, let's see if we can craft a weapon here with some of the items we have. Uh, components needed. Okay. Oh, we can make a weapon right here. Okay, we can make a little... Let me see right here. Alright, there are just two weapons we can craft so far. Let's see what they make, and uh, then we'll make them. Now, in order to get the best swords... Rubios, a wide-bladed sword whose name means red. Um, there are a lot of swords in the game that you can, like, get, unlock. But, um, it takes a lot of grinding and also just playing a lot, basically. You gotta play a whole lot. So, um, yeah, which is why I'm, I've said I'm not going to be, like, doing 100% LP on this game. Okay, equipment. Knuckles can only equip one item, which is really, really weird. But, uh, I don't know. I think he's paladin style, so maybe that's why. But, um, I think I'm gonna use, uh, this. Herb of Strength. Soul Gauge fills more easily. Though, then again, now that I think about it, he doesn't really need Soul Gauge, because, uh, his Soul Gauge attack is pretty bad, so I don't like it too much. But it doesn't look like we can equip anything else, so... Uh, we'll just do it. It does give points. Oh, yeah, and Knuckles is Paladin style. Shat Lancelot is, uh... Um, I think he's knight. He's balanced. And, uh, um, Sir Percival is, uh, oh my gosh, look at this place. Yeah, Sir Percival is, a uh, cavalier, so she's a lot faster. Knuckles is mostly, um, Knuckles is mostly, uh, attack-oriented, as you'd expect. So yeah, just chop these dudes up like a piece of cake. And, uh, like I've said before, these stages look amazing graphically. That's one thing about this game. It's very beautiful. Especially for a Wii game. It's like, wow, the grass and stuff like that. Like, you know, you see, like, games like, uh, what's the game called? Um, I'm trying to recall what it is. Uh, I think it was, like, Sonic Unleashed and stuff like that. If you look at the grass in that game, it doesn't look amazing. But, uh, in this game, it actually looks pretty awesome. So, uh, Knuckles' homing attack move, you kind of have to, uh, it's kind of weird. Dang it! He's got dual swords and stuff like that. Uh, he's pretty powerful. And, uh, uh, yeah, but I'm not too fun to, of playing with them, to be honest. So just chop through all these enemies. Look at that. That homing attack was just freaking beast mode. One thing about him, though, is that he can climb walls super easily and with amazing ease. It's pretty crazy. Okay, so right here, basically when you jump right here and finish climbing, do your sword attack, because uh, they are going to get you. Like, if you do it too late. Okay, now here's his attack. It's kind of weird. He tosses his swords out, and that's how you take 
enemies out with his, like, move. Good range and all, but, uh, it's not a good move, to be honest, in my opinion. It's kind of weird. Wee! Skadoosh! Yeah. Oh, balls. Freaking balls. Hey, you sons of guns. You freaking demon spiders. Take that. Hey, I'm talking to you. Hey, why won't he move? It's kind of weird sometimes. This game tries to incorporate 2D and 3D, like on Sonic Unleashed, but uh, it sometimes can't, like, it, the controls act all wonky and stuff, which is pretty bad. Okay, so just keep chopping these people up. Like, you know how with uh, Sonic and stuff like that, um, people complain about how you stop way too much? You stop a lot with this dude. Like, a lot. Okay. Okay. I think that's enough right there. I'm just gonna jump right here. Whoopsie. Whoa. Okay. Jump back. Alright, chop. Okay, I'm trying... If you get the lock and stuff like that, he won't move. Okay, see right there? If you get the lock, you'll free the people and uh, you'll get extra points. There we go. Oh, man. Look at that, he just took two enemies out throwing his swords. Pretty awesome. So here we go. Oh, that was a bad toss. Look at that though, it's like a boomerang. It's weird, but it's pretty awesome. Okay, so keep running forward. Because uh, it actually can though, when it comes back and can take out multiple enemies, it's pretty awesome in that way. But uh, it's pretty flawed still. Oh gosh, here. His attacks are pretty sluggish too. Okay, so usually when you're playing with Knuckles, uh, you find yourself doing a lot of woggling. A lot. And it gets really repetitive. It gives you a good workout, but uh, very repetitive balls. Okay. So chop that, nice. Okay, so just jump right here. Oh, crap. Oh my gosh, dude. Did you see those guys all over the place right there? Just keep chopping through them. It's like, uh, oh my gosh, you see that? See here, that's another thing with wobbling. Sometimes it just doesn't want to accept it because you just spam it so much. It's like, okay, are you wobbling or not? Oh my gosh, did you see that? That slammed right on my head and just stayed there. That was weird. Oh, you son of a gun. Alright, there we go. That got him. Oh, did you see that? Like the lizards and the wall and stuff like that? I mean, this game's really detailed graphically. It's just awesome. Chop you. Oh my gosh. Chopity chop chop. All right, nice. But see there, all those lizards. I mean, this game is really beautiful graphically. Whoa! Oh, look at that! I just keep chopping at his. Uh... There we go. See there, it whipped right behind him. So uh... there we go. And I was talking a lot, just about his moves. But see there. Since he's really good with combat and stuff like that, and just like with uh, like attacks and stuff, since he's like dual sword, um, you can get a really nice score playing with him. So, we upgraded ourselves a lot, and uh, new character available, new emblem component, new background music, and new mission available. Oh yeah, this game has a lot of online missions. I forgot to let y'all, I forgot to talk about that, because I hardly ever used it. Because back then, I didn't have a... Ooh, wow, look at that. We could use that. Um, the game actually has online gameplay, like, to where you can go online and go against, like, people in online missions and stuff like that. And, uh... It kind of extends the replay value a lot if you like the game. So, here we go. Cutscene time with Knuckles. Gawain. Yeah! hoo -ah! I struck gold. I am a rich. Secret sword pierces stone. So shall return the power. What of Excalibur, greatest of all 
sacred swords. The king wore its scabbard, but I never saw the sword itself. Okay. So, new stages have been added to battle mode, and new mission has been added to the Great Megalith. Nice. Alright, then. Well, uh, let's continue on. So, no, we're not doing that right now. Clear without being defeated? Heck no. Even though it's pretty easy, basically you just don't die there. But, um, this time we're going to be playing in, uh, what is it? I'm trying to get to it. Uh, come on. Thank you. You, Shrouded Forest, and this time we're going to be playing with Shadow. So, there we go. Let's go to the Blacksmith, though, briefly to equip him. And, uh, let me see right here. You can switch between them, so I'm gonna unequip that and put, like, a carnation there or something. I don't know. Unequip that, put that right there. Okay, now switch to, um, Shadow. And, uh,. Let me see right here. I could use the rabbit's tail. And then for this right here, uh, blah, 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 I don't know. I could use that actually. So let me unequip that. Whoopsie daisy. Uh, unequip item. How do you. What the flip? I'm trying to. Oh, wait. Look here. I'll just do that. Alright. So right here, now we're gonna equip that. And, uh, I think we're good to go here. So, I don't know, I just, I've always felt that it feels good to play Knuckles on that stage, uh, the Great Megalith, play with Shadow and Shrouded Force, and play with, the uh, Blaze Cat on the fire stage, since she's a fire cat. So here we go. Skadoosh! Don't flippin' mess with me! Don't flippin' mess with me! And, yeah, now I'm going off tune. So here we are, just running. See there, he has a kind of like a side homing attack. It's pretty cool, but um, kind of slow at times too. It's not as fast as uh, Sonic's move. All right, so uh, just jump right here. Screw that. I want the I want the treasure. Thank you. So um, yeah, this stage uh, pretty cool. Um, not my favorite stage by any means, but, um, make sure you watch out for, uh... Oh, look at this! We're just blazing through all this. It's pretty awesome. Okay, chop the tree's arms. Whoa! He grabbed me! What a tool! Um... Look at that! They're still grabbing at me. Okay. No. You keep your hands to yourself. Alright, keep chopping them. Alright, just make sure he doesn't get you. Alright. Just keep chopping at him. That's the best way to kill all these enemies in this game. Just keep waggle waggle sword. And instant win. Whoopsie. Alright, I'm trying to get the ring so I won't die or anything like that. Alright, here we go. Oh yeah. What? Skadoosh! Look at this, Shadow's freaking flying in this game, and what the flip, that was cheap, okay, you got Alright, here we go. Oh my gosh, it keeps, like the B button does not respond, but see here, anyway, Shadow does like his, uh, what is it, like a uh, signature uh, chaos control, but this time it's called chaos punishment! Because Shadow's always a beast, and uh, he's got to have cool names for everything he does. What? Okay, now I'm all confused from... What? Oh my gosh, did you see that? The Okay, I forgot about that enemy, what it does. Basically, when that enemy, like, shoots you with its beam of light, it makes you confused. I thought that it was actually a treasure chest, and I ran right into it and died. So, it's kind of funny. Look at us. Freaking demolish every single living, well, dead thing from the underworld right there. Ugh. Stupid homing attack doesn't work. I mean, sometimes this game just kicks you off at times. Okay. What the flip? 
This music's so epic. Whoopsie. No. No! Freaking stupid invisible wall. Curse you. Curse you for eternity. Oh my gosh, flipping balls. I thought I was gonna die right there. Here we go. Skadoosh! Oh yeah. I gotta say, I love Shadow's attack right here. His Chaos Punishment it is so awesome. I mean, check that out. He freezes every single flipping stupid enemy. It's like, screw you, you all can't do anything to me because y'all suck. I have the power of the Chaos. Heck yeah. Three stars. So yeah, not bad. Average. I, I just kept getting hit a lot because of unresponsive controls. Like, I kept... It just kept giving me cheap deaths and stuff like that and everything. It was like cheap hits and stuff like that. It was ridiculous. Okay, I want that. Oh my gosh, we hardly have any points. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna unlock that. Plant Thorn. And, uh, Doll. Alright, lovely. So now we got a cutscene with Shadow. This must be a barrier stone. Here we go. <gasps> We've struck gold again. We're rich. This stone is but part of the ring that sealeth the Dark Hollow. Dark Hollow? What is Merlina up to now? What the flip is it? Man. Flipping Dark Hollow shenanigans. Okay, so um, now a new mission has been added here. We're not going to do it though. Um, we're just going to continue trekking along with the story. So now we're going to the cauldron. And this time we're playing with freaking awesome sauce Blaze the Cat. So here we go. Well, Percival. So we're going to go to the blacksmith again to equip her. And uh, as we all, as I've said already, she is Cavalier. So, uh, yeah. I, I mean, yeah, she's just cav like her move is like cav Cavalier, so... I'm gonna swap that out right there. Swap that out for that. Actually, the soul gauge isn't really too... Like, the move is alright, but uh, it's not too amazing, in my opinion, for Blaze of Cat. Um, let me see right here. You gotta know how to use it really well. I think I'll do that. I think I'll do that. And then, uh, I think I'll do... Where's that? Should I do that? No, I'll do Rabbit's Tail so I can have a ton of valuable items and a ton of points. So yeah, she gets to equip three items. It's kind of cool. Alright, let's do this. And so far, already up to 28 minutes. So the next video probably... Like, I'll probably have one more video after this. And then it'll be the end of this LP. Like, the story. So. Okay, like I said, she's Cavalier. So she's extremely fast. If you know how to use her. Like, you can just chop through enemies extremely fast and just run all over the place like a son of a flipping gun. So, jump over the crows. Tools, your tools, your tools. Don't you even flipping think you can mess with me. Okay, here we go. Chop, 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 chop. You suck. Alright. Okay, now right here, you want to be extremely careful because this fire will kill you. Yeah, screw them. Okay. There's a treasure chest back here, so get that. Break these open for some rings, and, uh... Yeah, you can just fly through enemies with blaze. It's pretty cool, to be honest. Because, I mean, if you just want to blaze through the stage, then that's perfectly fine with you, and that matched. Oh my gosh! Woggle Woggle Sword didn't work! Woggle Woggle Sword didn't work! Sega! Why you... Oh my gosh, balls. Sega, why you no make Wii Motion Plus with this game? Woggle Woggle Sword didn't work. Dag nabbit. Alright, chop through him. Okay. Oh my gosh, Woggle Woggle Sword made me die. Alright. 
chop them. Stupid collision. Okay, get those rings right there. All right. Good thing. Woggle Woggle Sword is now working. No, it's not working. Dag nabbit. All right, be careful right here. Chop, 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 chop. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Lots and lots of enemies on this stage. Okay, nothing there. All right. Okay, now just come right here. Get all the rings you can get right here. Shut up, you tools who keep trying to attack me. All right. No. No, don't you dare touch me. Keep your hands to yourself. Keep your hands to yourself. All right, here you go. No! What? No! The game screwed me over. No! No! Where am I? No! No! Oh my gosh, you sent me all the way back here? Are you flipping for real, man? Are you for real? Oh my gosh. Flipping balls. Okay. You know, screw this shenanigans. Screw you, you dumb whores, you dumb whores, I've had enough of y'all, just hopping over you all, die in hell where you belong, you underworld cronies. Jump, jump, okay, wait for it, no, 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 okay, here we go, nice, they will knock you off if you let them, it's weird. It is really bad right there, that section. Especially with Blaze, because uh, she doesn't have a good homing attack. Okay, so make sure you dodge the fire geysers. Dang it, it's almost unavoidable, that one right there. Holy flipping balls, look at this awesome cinematic. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you, this game is gorgeous. One of the most beautiful Wii games you can ever find. Like you thought, like Super Mario Galaxy and stuff like that was pretty? Well, they are. This is insanely pretty in my opinion. Even though Super Mario Galaxy 2 is insanely pretty. But I mean, this game is gorgeous. Like just all the lighting effects and everything they did with this game. They really kind of tried to make it as detailed as possible, which is kind of awesome. But Sega's known for doing that. Okay. Right, just do a quick jump, chop, and uh, take these enemies out. Oh my gosh, hell, 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 hell. Okay, here we go. All right, this is her, like, fire attack, basically. Allows you to take out enemies, and the uh, thing is, is that it really dies out fast if you don't know how to use it well, and, uh, what? This is craziness. Blaze is my least favorite character in the game, though, because of how she controls and fights, though. She's really fast, but I don't like how she fights. But uh, one cool thing is that she can really glide up walls fast, run on walls fast. Pretty cool. Okay, just make sure you don't hit the spikes. All right. Whoa, hello there. I was not expecting you. Alright, drop a bit. Just one ring? Okay. Alright, drop, drop, drop. Oh my gosh, that could have exploded and hit me. Alright. Keep climbing up. Alright. Drop. Okay, and then we can just keep climbing up. Yeah. Oh yeah, skadoosh! And there we go at the goal. 
Ah, Wagga Woggle Sword. Wagga Woggle Sword. That's all I can say right now to that score. Woggle Woggle Sword. It wasn't my fault, totally. So, oh my gosh, we got a ton of identification points. We got a Ruby, we got a Topaz, we got a Bat Spang, we got the Heart Attack. Okay, we got a lot of stuff here. We got a Steel Axe. I know that's a Bronze. Okay, uh. I guess I'll just unlock this. Oh, a Cursed Axe. I don't think I've ever, I don't remember ever getting that. And we got another cutscene here. This must be it. Hoo-ah! Our fate is now in your hands, Sir Sonic. It's all up to you. You can do it, Sonic! All right. Dragon Slayer, new mission has been added to battle, new stage has been added to battle mode, and a new mission has been added to the cauldron. Lovely. So, uh, gosh, we got a lot of stuff here. Uh, maybe we won't finish in this, like, I thought I was just going to go to the final boss in, the, in, like, the next video, but I think next time I'll be doing Dragon Slayer, or, let me see. Yeah, I think I'll do that next time. So um, anyway, thanks again for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the video. I will see you all. Have a good day.